What's going on, you legends? We are back with another SnowRunner video. It's it's been a while since we made one. I finally figured out how to get over here. We'll look at the map real quick. So if you go across this and you make this right here and follow down here, you can cross through this and you can either go up over here or go up over here to get over here. So that's how I got over here. I have not reached this yet just because this vehicle is out of fuel and I need to get a fuel truck up there to get this last this watch tower. But today we are going to use the wrong grad. We are going to try to get to this watch tower if we can. We may just explore this main path though and see just open up a map a little more so it's just be more of an exploring vehicle or exploring video today hopefully you guys day is going well mine is as always it's been a while I know there's an update I don't know what update it was though for it because an update did happen so yeah, but for Monday's video, I do have two videos in the next couple of days coming out. One's going to be Rainbow Six Siege for sure. Well, two of them are going to be the Rainbow Six Siege ones. I just don't know what day I'm going to have them. So they're in the process of uploading eventually. This is going to be a Sunday video, so hopefully it's out there for you guys by then. As we try to winch out of this deep snow. This deep snow sucks. I will tell you that. I'm hoping to find at least a fuel station. There is not a garage on this map. Which kind of sucks. Um, we're going to put the part, or handbrake on. We're going to go to the map. I'm going to turn this today real quick. Just because I want to look at some of this stuff. Like... Some of these graphics and that that looks cool and old ship crashed and still there. Get like a tall watchtower up there. So yeah, it's just gonna be exploring kind of this main road, seeing like if we can find like a new vehicle. I don't know how many vehicles we will get on this map. We will see you how much we can get to. Hope I can get to that watchtower. That's gonna be the goal. I mean, if I don't get to it, I don't. I think we are stuck. Well, all wheel drive is off. That may help. If we had our all wheel drive on, I didn't realize we had it off. I thought we left it on. Uh, okay, let's see if we can attach something heavier. There we go. That's a bigger tree. We'll get out of this rock, hopefully. We're gonna try to reverse out. It's just this rock we're sitting on right here. So if I can go to the right a little. There we go. Maybe. Let's see if we can pull us back real quick. Now, if I can go just right of this. We should be set, but it's like getting caught on that rock still. Let's see if we can just winch us a little to the side without tripping ourselves. There we go. Hopefully, that gets us out. We should. There we go. Took a little longer than I wanted. It's alright. Now you know the struggle of the game. So I don't know how much we are going to explore on this. I do need a scout vehicle. But the scout vehicle... I, ooh, dude, we took a lot of damage there. I thought that was lower. I'm not going to lie. 
I didn't think it was that low or high up, but it was. So we I guess we'll learn hard way. It's gonna be harder, just because the DLC map they're gonna make this harder now, make it tougher terrain to where you may have to use two vehicles to get them out. Oh, I won't have to. I did take this from the peninsula map and brought it up here just because I know we will eventually have to deliver stuff and I don't have a delivery truck up here so we're gonna use the Braun Grad as my delivery truck and it has a small crane at least so that's the reason why I took it we did have other options but those options didn't really please me on what I wanted and so we took a lot of damage our suspension's not the greatest so climbing up this hill is gonna kind of suck we'll get up here after when we get like to a flatter ground just so we're not on a hill and like don't I mean yeah we could put our handbrake on but in real to be realistic kind of we're gonna get on top of this little hill here so we don't roll back downhill and have to climb this thing again and we'll take a quick look at the map see where we are it looks like there's a path that way oh we're stuck on a giant rock so, so we'll stop here real quick look at the map see uh we traveled far. This looks like a field of some sort. But we are going to continue on this main path instead. It is that watchtower should open up everything here. At least that's what I'm hoping for. I don't know if we have a flat. I don't think we do. That shouldn't be the reason why we can't climb up the hill. It looks like... Looks like a uh, factory of some sort here we can access. This is what it looks like. So we're going to take a look at this factory or lumber yard, whatever it is. Nothing in there that I see. No objectives. We're going to break through this ice and get stuck in mud. Open? Okay, I was like, I'm hoping I can reach that pole. Because that's what I wanted to winch to. That's why I winched that little stump in the ice and mud. We're going to make that our goal. We have 380 meters to go. So we're going to try to make it there. This looks like... Factory. I don't know if there's a fueling deal here. If so, we will use it. I'm going to assume there would be, but no promises on a fueling station. Let's take a look on what this is. So this is Broken Power Station. We'll take a look at the end of the video on what we need to do. That looks like a delivery spot. or. Oh, so this is something we're going to have to fix up, it looks like. This looks like our truck depot, where it would be where we can get fuel and repair. Everything is what it looks like. So it's just a cargo container, fuel, vehicle spare parts, and that's it. So no, I mean, this is a loading zone. There is something over there that has a big trailer. I am going to have to bring a different vehicle up here to attach to those trailers. There's been two or three that I've seen so far. That, I don't know if they're going to be objectives or what they are going to be. I was hoping for a garage on this map, but there isn't, which sucks because if you flip and you don't have a proper vehicle to tow or pull the vehicle over, you have to recover it, and it sucks, trust me. So we will look. This looks like a... Oh, it is a trailer shop. Okay, so there's a trailer shop. 
take a look here real quick. Wide flatbed semi trailer installation wide. Okay. So what? Wide semi. I just gonna look. Um, to be honest, I don't remember if that's been in the game or not. I don't think it has. I think this is a new trailer. Uh, let's stop our engine real quick. So, this was what we found broken power station. So, we have to deliver it up here. We have two metal beams, and those are up there. But, this warehouse, what was this for? Is it something in here that we need to do? Um, it don't look like it. So we did get new, like main task, I guess you can call it, main contracts that are new that are on this map. So this is the stone labyrinth. Labyrinth. I can't speak. We got the. Megalith, two of them. Look at the Cola Expedition places with military glory. We got four battery, Umba battery, Tuma battery, Kanda battery, and Varzuga. Probably saying all those wrong. The price of victory. So find metal detector module. Okay, that's a new equipment. We'll make that a video. For sure. Drive to the lost B eight twenties. Okay. Deliver to the airport. Okay, that's the airport. We know where that is. B A twenty armor car, B A twenty armor car. Okay. So that's new. The stars in the sky. So drive to the airplane wreck. So this is the map where we are gonna find the airplane. I was hoping we would, so this is gonna be a lot of videos coming up eventually. So we do need a saddle hide for this and a flatbed trailer and the metal detector. So we will do all this as a big video, like a series again like we did with the previous ones. We got all of these still that we will do eventually, but we're not going to do them just quite yet. So let's start this back up, see if we can get to this marker. Looks like a giant swamp. I don't think we go that way, right? Oh, we can. But I don't think we want to, do we? I'm feeling we may have to get to the washout. We're going to follow the main road, though, like I said. Just because we will get stuck. There is that washtower, so. There's probably upgrades in here, but... We're just going to follow this, just because I don't want to winch all day trying to get through mud and then waste fuel. I mean, doing this is going to waste fuel, but... I can't winch out on so and so I got to use the gas here. See if we can winch somewhere else. No, we'll see if we can reverse out of here. Okay, well, it looks like we're gonna go that way just because we got stuck there. So we're gonna go through the mud instead, guys. Granted, off road tires would be the best. I have chain tires on these just for icy roads, but the icy roads aren't gonna be that big of an issue for me just because most of this is off-road so I will probably take the chains off of my trucks and just run with off-road or mud tires so let's go to the left just because that's where we need to go anyways 
Oh, I thought we'd go up that rock. I guess we can't. Okay. Hopefully we don't sink. I don't think we will. To be honest, this isn't looking too good. If I get on these rocks, it would help, but I just can't get up there. What if we just back out and try to angle it? I don't think we'll be able to do that. We may... Oh, oh, there we go. That's what I was wanting. Whoops, don't know why I turned off the all wheel. Okay, let's take a quick look. So, we're on this rock. We need to go this way to these rocks to get onto this little road. Without trying to damage this too much. Oh, that was a deep dive. Pull us up. Using that stump there. So it is possible to actually go this way and get up the, on these rocks. These rocks are actually helping me. Because there's no way I was making it. Just go to the left a little so we don't damage our vehicle any more than it is. Thing is, we have to climb up this. And that's going to be the goal, is just to get that today, if I can. Hopefully we don't run out of fuel. So we're getting a little bit low. And it would suck to bring a trailer and a truck back up here. I should have bought like a repair uh, service, maintenance service trailer to repair it, just to give us a little power. That's what I should have done at the trailer store. But grant most of this is meant for scout vehicles. And at the moment, I don't have a good one. I mean, the Ford is the only scout vehicle I believe I have, but it's not that great. To me. Okay, take a look at our map one more time. So, I'm going to assume if we wrap around this, we will eventually get up there, it looks like. I should have just continued that way, but man, I should have stuck to it and just continued down that path. We'll make it work. Somehow. I'm going to get wedged in here, I have a feeling. We get stuck in here, we're just gonna end the video there. Because there's no way I can reverse out of this. We're right in the wall. We're gonna take a lot of damage here. I'm glad there's a lot of winchable points, but this is not the vehicle to do it in. I'm making this harder on me. You guys are probably laughing and enjoying it. I just need a solid tree up there. I have a feeling we're st stuck.
I don't think we're gonna get out of this. We may have to end it here, and I don't wanna. Oh, maybe not. We got through that somehow. Don't know what we did. It's just too rocky. I mean, Grant, this is a mountains, but even on a scout vehicle, wouldn't be able to get through this, I don't think. Let's just go up high. There we go. Now we can turn off all wheel. Okay, I guess we're not. It's deep snow. So, do we make this left is the question. I think we make this left. Well, let's go straight because there's like nothing here. It looks like. Look at that flowing water. That looks sick. That looks amazing. You know something's going to be delivered down here. You know it. Because or we have to get that stupid container. You can see it there because there's a mark like yellow objected over it so you know we're gonna have to get that container but we're not doing that now <laughs> let's just get to this marker so we can call it a video because this video has actually been stressful believe it or not I'm probably not gonna edit much of this out it's just gonna stay in here just so you guys can suffer with me in the pain that I'm going through. The slow, hard pain. <laughs> it's like struggling. I mean, I know it's deep in snow and mud, but still. With all wheel drive, you think it'd be easy. Maybe this will help because we're getting on a little bit flatter snow and land, but not really. Oh, we're going to have to go all the way around. I already know it. I already can tell. I'm glad I didn't bring a trailer with me. I was thinking about bringing a fuel trailer, but kind of glad we didn't. Cuz it would not be fun at all through this. I mean, it's Pushing through this, but not great. Take one more look at the map. So, we need to go up here. And then we should get to the objective. We got 126 liters. I better make it there. Because I'm going to be one frustrated man. If I can't get it there. Before I run out of fuel. This is meant for a scout. Now it is. But the main road it isn't really meant for the scout. Come on. Pull up. You can get up there. Slowly but surely. Get up here. There you go. Now it kicked into a different gear it seemed like. So we only have like 90 meters to get to there and then like probably 80, 70 meters to get to the actual deal. If those rocks were there, I'd just go straight to it, but the mountain rocks are right there blocking it, so you have to go up this road. I probably made it harder, because that main road would just took me to that small road where I had to go to. Oh. Turned a little too quick, because that tree stopped us. I heard they're bringing logging eventually too. I don't know when that's going to come out to be honest guys. I'm going to try to get this done. Hopefully like this end of this phase one. Because this is still phase one. It's just an update to the season. So I don't know how long seasons are going to be. I don't know how long. 
I'm assuming this isn't gonna last phase one, it's gonna last till the end of the year. And then they'll bring out phase two. But I also don't know. I'll do some research unless one of you guys wants to do some research and put it in the comment section for people instead. I mean, I'll probably do some research, see if I can find and mention it in a different video or put it in the comment section or something or in my description. So look for the description, comment, or my next video on SnowRunner if I find anything on it and talk about it. We have a hundred, almost a hundred liters left of gas. This is gonna be a longer video than I want, but it's all right. Content is content. I mean, just making our way up the mountain, slow, pain, so much pain. It's like a song that my uh, sister watched, I can't remember the TV show, it was a cartoon when she was little, she would always watch it, it was like her favorite, can we go up here first? Yeah, we have to go this way, so we have to go like over here a little to get up to here. Anyways, back to that story I was saying, I don't remember what the TV show was called, but I had a robot, and it sang a songs like pain, all I know is pain. Or something. I don't remember what the show was called. I'll have to ask her, see if she remembers. Or maybe one of you guys may know. I don't know. I was like, what is this? <laughs> like, why is this a song? I mean, it's just for a kid's program, anyways. So I was like, uh. I don't know if that even shows out. I can't even think what it's called the show, to be honest. I don't think it's even out anymore. And if so, I don't know about it. <laughs> she doesn't watch it. Oh no. I mean, I get it, we make it tough with rocks. But don't make rocks gigantic. Especially on the path I have to travel on. Oh, good God. <laughs> the only path I can go up is here. And there's no winchable point. So we are going to climb up. We got 78 liters. We should be able to get there. Go up here where there's not so many rocks and use it to help climb. Go to the left a little with the wheel. Go to the right. Get up there. No, slide down it. What if I put the diff lock on, will it help? Oh my gosh. Why should I, I should have done that earlier. Okay, maybe I shouldn't have. So now we're stuck. Oh, 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 oh. What are we stuck on? I'm gonna waste all our gas here, our diesel here. Just trying to get up this slope just so we don't get stuck but we're getting stuck there we go I had to go left a little more no don't slide down no why did it slide in stay up continue there's no points to attach to the winch but it's all right finally get up here okay now we're gonna go to the right over this little boulder then we'll go to the left of it get those back wheels over I'm gonna be mad if that was the way to go up Okay, it's not. I'm glad there's not an upgrade down there because I'm not getting up from it. It's on the front end. Are you serious? The objective point is on the front. I'm glad you don't have anything down there, game. Okay, it's not too far. We finally made it. Got the watchtower. We'll just launch it just to show you guys the map more. 
on what we're looking for and at. Uh, there's that cargo. Let's just stop the engine. We are not leaving this spot. <laughs> we're just going to stay there. So let's take a look. We got a contest called Dirty Business, it looks like. So this is a recycling station. No. Yeah. So that's the recycle station. So let's take just a little bit of a look. This is looking like a farm, kind of. I don't know. Can I... Yeah, we can do here. So landslide in the mountains. Well, that's over here, because that's blocked. A keepsake sake we have there. I have to go to the things is the issue and look at them. That's what sucks. So landslide in the mountains. Oh, so that's the objective marker for here. For way over there. Okay. Nightmare delivery is a this vehicle that we did pull out. I believe it was over here. We pulled it here, I think. I don't remember. We had to, like, deliver it up here. Magnitude of 5 is another deal that we have to do. I'm assuming it's somewhere in the dark zone. Well, it's up here. Bro, this map is actually big. Actually, this magnitude of 5 looks like a passageway. To be honest, because right here, I can't go any left any further than here. So it looks like it could be, like, a new passage. So I'm going to assume the main road did run up to there. We got the floating change house. That's great. Old scrap metal is a some mission. Old lighthouse. Floating change house. There's two of them. No way. We have to take if we had to take that over there. That's gonna suck. Picture to remember. So this is the metal. Place is where we get our beams. Oh God! After making this treacherous journey, I mean, we can go probably through here. That probably won't be as bad, but I'm not going through that thing. Uh, there's a fuel scout fuel carrier, so there is a little fuel there. But we will eventually have to come down to here and get this metal detector module, because I guess that's going to help us find the plane. We do have one watchtower left. We are so close to getting it. We just need to get a fuel trailer up here to get fuel for that. So that's the only upgrade we have so far. Well, not really an upgrade to, to attach. Uh, nothing in there. We already looked at those. So, yeah. So, next video. Uh, to be honest, I don't know when the next video will come out. Looks like we do have a scout flatbed and another fuel carrier trailer that's meant for ours which would have been better I should have just continued actually I wouldn't have because I would have to stop here probably anyways it's probably blocked off but maybe it's not I don't know I I mean I may do something janky with this I, look at my fuel again I could probably make it down here. I don't know if I'll make it all the way there, though. That's what I'm hoping I can do, but I probably won't. But if we did a video next time on this, to be honest, if I do make it to there, we will probably look at these two and do these two. But if those aren't as important as I'm thinking they are we'll just get this fuel and then we'll head back on this main road and make this left here go here and then get this metal detector module I do need to rescue this or I need to either recover this or bring a fuel carrier up here but I do need to bring something over here I'm surprised I didn't select oh because it's on the opposite side I believe I think I just need like metal or something to move it. So yeah, that's what I plan on doing in the next video. This is all dark. I'm assuming there's a bunch of stuff up here too. But to be honest, I don't know. 
this didn't open up as much as I thought it was so we will have to do a lot of exploring eventually we will have to come down here do this eventually see if there's anything good like upgrade wise there's probably a contract or something down in here that we'll have to do I'm really hoping this like connects like where it's dark it connects to either like something no well, not there like it probably connects to something down in here what it looking like but I'm hoping it like connects like over here and wraps over here and matches with those so we can at least get across but yeah so anyways guys we're gonna end the video there I got what I wanted I want to get to this watchtower we did make quite a journey if I knew that metal detector module was there I would have done that first thing but I didn't know it was there so we will end the video there guys Thank you guys for watching. Remember to subscribe. You guys are legends of my book. And I'll see you guys in the next one.